a very good day to all of you um, this video is recorded for the purpose of explaining the format and the details of the final assessment of um, this subject academic reading and writing UBI 20402 so we have done with the synthesizing as well as um, writing the full research paper in which you did with your group members and the submission would be um, this week um, for your case um, so um, in the um, assignment uh, you needed to write around 800 words of a research paper and before that you wrote the um, integrated outline which is the full draft and then you uh, came out with the full research paper of 800 words and um, so we have discussed in detail about synthesizing paraphrasing uh, from the videos uploaded before this uh, so those are the things including citations and references um, thesis statement topics and so on. those are the things that uh, we need to have in our uh, research paper so that is uh, the idea of what a research paper is um, so this is a sample of um, um, a full research paper that you did for your um, assignment uh, that the one that we have discussed previously so we had uh, these uh, the general background uh, the topic sentence in uh, sorry the thesis statement in yellow the topic sentence in pink and this is the um, description or the discussion and this is where you synthesize with the point uh, the information that you got from the internet from the articles and then you have the citation um, the same goes to the other paragraphs and in the end you have the conclusion the concluding sentence um, the you reiterate the main points and the future actions and the references following APA 7 edition so this is about uh, 800 words and for your final assignment final assessment um, you are going to write similar things um, the format is similar it is just that the number of words is shorter because you'll be given two hours to come out with a full research paper um, so how do you synthesize you are you will be given three excerpts or three attacks for your final assessment so that that means you don't have to go to the internet uh, looking for articles like uh, you did with your final assignment uh, sorry if, like you did for your written assignment the full research paper but for the final assessment you'll be given three not not a full articles but three excerpts from three articles so that means you will have to synthesize your information from these three articles into your full research paper in, into your essay so everything is similar except the final assessment is shorter so the number of words would be 350 words but you can go up to 400 words um, that would still be okay um, so your final your assignment 800 words but in the final assessment everything is similar just the number number of words would be shorter 350 words but uh, if you cannot help um, or you, you you need to describe more um, you can go until 400 words um, so this is a sample of the final um, assignment or the final assessment so let's say this is the topic um, so this is the topic um, produce an academic article with proper citations entitled youth and exposure to digital technology integrate information from text one two and three so 
what you need to do is you need to do the similar thing that you did with your final uh, with your assignment and the title here is youth and exposure to digital technology so what about it are you going to talk about uh, good things are you going to talk about the side effects so that depends on the text that you will read later so that means you'll have to synthesize um, the points from the text um, so this is not your um, final assessment this is just a sample so let us take a look at the text so text number one social media use among youth um, so you need to read these excerpts this text to know what um, it is about so you can uh, decide what points you will have so let's say uh, this one talk about mental health crisis so that means um, in your essay uh, your first paragraph for example will be talking about uh, the side effect of um, digital media on youth um, screen violence and youth behavior so that means uh, digital media can also cause uh, violence among young people so that means again it is uh, the negative effect of um, negative effect of um, digital technology article number three social media promotes engagement with uh, tobacco and e-cigarettes so again it is negative thing so that means in your thesis statement you'll be talking about uh, the side effects or the or the negative effects of uh, digital technology towards young people so so once you have read the text what you need to do is you need to come out with the full research paper um, so this is a sample so this is the title this is the general background this is the thesis statement this is the topic sentence firstly digital technology will have potential in affecting the mental health of youngsters so if you read the thesis statement here it says that although there are agreements and the disagreements on the exposure of youth to digital technology it cannot be denied that digital technology can have its downsides towards teens so that means when people read your thesis statement people know that in your essay you are going to talk about the side effects of digital technology towards teenagers so if you take a look at the second um, topic sentence exposure to digital technology influence the act of violence thirdly exposure of youth to digital technology promotes the engagement of youth in tobacco and e-cigarettes so these are the explanations and you can see this is the citation uh, and this in 2017 herbert 2017 uh, royal society for public health 2017 so these citations come from these um, the texts so that means you'll have to follow apa 7th edition for the citation and in the end you have the references so so that is the format what is the format similar to your assignment but it is shorter your assignment 800 words your final assessment similar uh, the number of words would be 350 words but you can go up to 400 words or slightly more than that that is fine um, you don't have to color code your um, when you submit uh, what you need to do is you need to have your name metric number and your class no need to have a um, no need to have the uh, cover page um, just your name on top of the paper um, so you can decide how many words per paragraph so let's say if you have uh, let's say you want to make it 400 words so that means uh, 100 words for the first paragraph uh, for Per body paragraph 1 100 words for body paragraph 2 100 words for body paragraph 3 and 50 words for conclusion and 50 words for introductions but up to you as long as uh, what you need to deliver is delivered so that is all about it any questions you may you can always um, ask me in the whatsapp group uh, you can either uh, text in the 
uh, group or personally so thank you very much um, good luck for the final assessment